you a public servant? Do you work for the government? Or would you like to work for the government? If so, cost-benefit analysis is the right course for you. I say that because governments often need advice from public servants about which course of action is the best for a particular policy or a program or a project. So for example, the government may ask you whether they should build a road or a railway to a new industrial area. Or they may ask what the best drug might be, what the best medicine might be to treat malaria in the population. A long time ago when I worked in the Treasury, I was asked to provide advice on whether Australia should build a spaceport in Queensland using Russian-made rockets to launch satellites into space. Well, fortunately, I was able to use cost-benefit analysis and provide an answer. The question was, is this a good thing or not? Would the country benefit from it or not? And the answer was negative, so the government didn't proceed with it. And I've always been a fan of cost-benefit analysis since then, because it's just so useful for giving advice on so many different topics. Students sometimes come to me and they're worried because they think they need to use a lot of mathematics to do cost-benefit analysis. This course, you don't need any maths whatsoever. It's more a question of how to think and think differently. And that's quite difficult sometimes, but you don't need any maths in this course. The assessment comes in two bits in this course. The first bit is an essay where you get to read a real cost-benefit study and comment on the good points in the study and the not so good points. And I don't mind if you work together with your friends because you actually learn more that way. But the essay itself has to be written by you. The second part of the assessment is an exam at the end of the course. And here you need to answer a question, for example, should the government build a pipeline so that farmers can produce more crops? And that's a fairly straightforward thing to do. And if you've done the essay properly, then you'll easily be able to answer the exam question. So come and enjoy the course and I hope to see you next semester.